In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Ableton to OBS. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly set up Ableton and make sure that you can record it within OBS. So to make sure that you can sync the audio between both of these devices and software, you will be able to use this plugin available at reaper.fm. So look for replugs. This plugin will help you synchronize the recording to OBS. So just download it here and you will be able to run the installer. Once you have the plugin good to go, then the first thing that you have to do is within Ableton, move the plugin to the master track. So you will have the master track, just make sure that you drag and drop the plugin that you downloaded onto it. So once the plugin has been applied to the master track, you will see a window like this. And all that you have to do is choose the option to send audio slash MIDI through IP. And instead of including a custom IP, just choose local broadcast. So select the arrow and then select local broadcast. So now this audio will be sent accordingly. Now within OBS, create a new source and what you have to do is a new audio input source. Right click this and go on to the filters. Inside of the filters for the audio input that you just created, you will be able to add a new VST plugin and we are able to include the plugin that we just downloaded. So input the plugin that you used within Ableton now included in OBS. Once again, you will see the same window like this and you should be able to use it to record the master track of Ableton. So anytime that you do something within the program, it is going to appear here. Now, as long as you have it selected to receive audio, you will be good to go. However, if you notice that your microphone is also being recorded, then what you can do is add a new gain filter. So press the plus sign, choose the option to add a gain filter and just lower it all the way to the back. So minus 30 dB. If it's still, if it is still picking up your microphone, you can just add a new gain filter and just keep adding more and more until your microphone is not being detected anymore. That way only Ableton will be recorded on OBS. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Ableton to OBS. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.